trying to decide which boots to get for your upcoming fire season. In today's video, we are going to review the famous White's boots to see if they're worth that heavy price tag. Hey there, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Ronnie Ocampo. Fire season is coming up and so I wanted to review my White's boots and tell you why I think they are definitely worth the price tag. So why I like these boots so much is because they're all leather and they are very durable. I did not take care of these like I should have, um, but they're still in pretty good shape and they're very comfortable. The breaking time was really quick for me and the best part is that they can be rebuilt. I know they have a couple different styles on their website now. When I was getting into fire, I literally went into my local boot store and was like, hey, I need fire boots, and this is what they handed me. So thankfully I got whites, because now that I talk to any firefighters, about nine out of 10, they will always recommend getting whites because they are just so durable and they can be rebuilt, like I said. These are an investment though, so they're gonna run you between five to $600 brand new. However, I'm sure you can find some that are either refurbished or rebuilt for cheaper but I really want you to get brand new ones because you're gonna want them to be molded to your feet. Your feet are your money maker in this career and so you really wanna make sure you're investing and this is where I would recommend investing is in your boots, high quality boots. I know that there are some people who say there are different brands or different companies that they would recommend. I've only had these boots so I can only recommend these ones, but they're very durable, they're comfortable, so that's why I recommend these ones. So let's talk about the anatomy of the boot real quick. So it's all leather, which I really like. These ones have a heel, so when you're hiking, you're on steep terrain, it's really nice to be able to dig your heels in to help with that. Um, these came with leather laces. Uh, like I said, I had these for seven seasons, so they have eventually broken down so small because once they would break off, I just like retie them together but the laces got so small that I had to throw them out and I got synthetic laces and put those in. Um, you can tie your boots a certain way so that way um, it doesn't bite you or do like a snake bite. That's what I know them as. It's where it just pinches your skin. Like mine go right here is where it would pinch me at. So you can um, lace your boots a certain way. So if you guys are interested in a video like that, please uh, let me know down in the comments. And then how I broke these in, and they were really fast to break in, was I would pour hot water in here and then I'd put my feet in there and then walk around, like not too hot water, it's scalding your feet, right? But I would just put warm hot water in here, walk around um, so that the leather would get kind of pliable and then it would mold to my feet. These are way too big for me. So again, seven seasons, wrong size, but I never changed them, I guess, so, or exchanged them. So when I was thinking about sizing, I, would, I was thinking, okay, I'm gonna be wearing at least two pairs of socks and I need room for my foot to be able to move. And plus, once you are hiking, you're gonna have, your foot's gonna kind of swell a little bit, so I'm gonna need extra room for that. Um, I went a little bit too big. And like I said, it's five or 600 bucks a boot for your boots. So I just, I just rolled with too big of boots. So I'm gonna need to invest in a, in a, a different size of boots this time. But um, so again, for sizing, make sure you're thinking about how many pairs of socks you're gonna have or the thickness of your socks and also account for your foot swelling a little bit. But definitely don't go like ham like I did I bet you like my foot goes to here like I have a whole my foot just slides around in there it's it's not good these are an investment however if I'm paying five or six hundred bucks and I've had these for seven years I say that I got my money's worth so I will leave the link down in the description box below if you guys are interested in checking out a pair of these boots um, this video is not sponsored like I said however I do have my affiliate link with Amazon so if you guys purchase the boots through there then I get a little commission which I appreciate or you can just go onto the White's website and purchase the boots through there too. Um, so yeah, hope you guys like this video. If so, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.